welcome back to another huge pretty little thing haul. I have four huge bags of product that has just arrived to me from Pretty Little Thing and in this video I'm going to be sharing it with you, I'm going to be opening my packages, I'm going to be telling you my honest opinion on everything and I'm going to be sharing with you what I think of the quality, the size, the fit, what I would style them with and then I'm also going to be trying it all on and letting you know exactly what I think of it on and showing you a realistic view of how it's going to look. So I am a pretty regular size 8 uh, just for reference and I'm, a, I'm about 5 foot 4 so yeah I hope that helps. If you are new here my name is Beth, it is so nice to have you here that I am a mum of three, stepmom to one, I live in the UK with my husband, my two gorgeous French Bulldogs and this channel is all things family, lifestyle, parenting and fashion so if you like any of those things go and hit the subscribe button, hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any videos because it is vlogmas which means we are doing one video every single day which is absolutely killing me so I hope you all appreciate it um, and yeah there are so so many videos on my channel and loads coming every day coming up so yeah let's get straight into this pretty little thing haul I hope you enjoy it and make sure you leave me loads of comments below and let me know which products you liked and which you didn't. So when I said I have a lot of product to show you, I have a lot. <laughs> so let's get stuck straight in. I literally don't even know where to begin. So I'm going to put the links for everything in the description box. If you are in the UK or the US then sizing and prices are going to be different so I'm just going to link everything below um, so you can just click through and see the current price and everything there. So yeah, let's get straight in. Let's start having a look what's in these bags. Okay, so the first thing I want to show you is this Unreal Bomber. I've actually had this out and worn this already yesterday and I loved it. My friend absolutely loved it. I had it on all day yesterday. It was so nice and warm. So it's this like bomber, but it's like a faux fur, like shearling material. And it's like super padded as well, like on the arms. It feels really like cozy and padded. It's like gathered on the sleeves as well. So it just makes it look really nice and puffy. And also on the back. And yeah, it's just obviously the black wool on the outside and then the white on the pockets and the sleeves. It looked so nice on and I absolutely loved it. So I got this in a size medium. I will show you the picture on here of how I styled it yesterday. I loved the whole outfit and yeah, it was really nice. So really super warm. Um, I would say if you wanted it to fit like I do, then size up because I'm not a medium, I'm more of a small, but I got the medium and it looked so, so nice on. So that was definitely a winner. The next thing that I've got to show you are these amazing pair of mint colour joggers. So they have a matching sweatshirt which is in there also somewhere, but I just live in joggers. Like my whole Instagram is just joggers. I have so many and I, but I don't have any in this lovely mint colour and I just thought they'd be really, really nice. So yeah, they're in this lovely like sage minty colour and I got a size... I got a size 10 which is a US size 6 and they feel really nice, They're feeling, they feel really nice and thin and lightweight, they've got the cuffs at the ankles so I'll be able to roll them up if I want to and what the waistband is really nice and stretchy, yeah I really like those so I'm definitely going to style these with like trainers, the matching sweatshirt, maybe little crop tops as well but you could definitely wear them as well with heels and dress them up, I love that whole like joggers and heels look at the moment. So yeah, I absolutely love those. And then I wore it with this white long sleeve PLT top, which is just like a PLT branded long sleeve like baggy loose t-shirt. Um, so it just says PLT down the sleeve like that. I just think it's a really nice thing to have in your wardrobe because I do have a lot of white sweatshirts and hoodies and I really like wearing them like under jackets and stuff like that. But sometimes it can be too hot, especially if you like going in and out of places. So I got this, which is a thinner alternative and it is so nice. I wore it yesterday, I was shopping, I had my big jacket on. I wasn't like overly hot at all, it was just right. So it's a really nice thin like t-shirt material. So it's just a really nice essential to have in your wardrobe. Just this PLT down both sides. Uh, on the sleeves and yeah it's a bit crease sorry because I did wear it yesterday but I absolutely love that. I got that in a size medium as well because I wanted it to be a really nice like boxy oversized fit but then also be able to like tuck it up and stuff as well so yeah that's a really nice little basic to have. And then the trousers that I wore with the outfit are these which are these black 
faux leather cropped pants. Now I thought they were more of a legging when I ordered them, but they're not, they're more of a trouser. So they're like more of a trouser fit. So they're not like skin tight. These were size eight. They were still quite kind of loose and more like a tailored fit. Um, so if you wanted them tighter, I would definitely say go down a size because these are a size eight and they were slightly too big on me. They have a zip up at the back and then they just have a really nice tailored fit and then they're slightly cropped. So if you like wearing like trainers with like socks and stuff, then they're perfect because they look really nice with those. But they'd also look really, really nice with heels too. So yeah, I loved these yesterday. That whole outfit was just so comfy. A really nice casual kind of day outfit. Okay, and then the next thing I ordered was this, which is this big like faux... Um, it's like a fur zip up like top Get it out. so yeah I just thought it's really nice to have in your wardrobe at the moment again it would look amazing just with like joggers a bomber over the top just I just thought it was really nice just to have to chuck on for like dead casual days where you want to be really snuggly and warm and I just think it's going to look so, so nice. It will look amazing with joggers. It will look really nice with like some mum jeans and trainers and then under jackets and stuff too. It's actually so soft. I actually really, really like that. It's so soft on. And it's like this grey charcoal -y colour. I got a size large in this just because I wanted it to be massive so that I could kind of fold it over and have it really nice and big. And I really like that. It's so super soft. It's going to look really nice on, I think. And then next up is this amazing black puffer jacket. I've already taken this out and tried it on because I'm just obsessed with like puffer jackets. And I love the like kind of wet look kind of style to them. Being a mom of three boys, I have a lot of football going on at the weekend. So this is gonna be my new football coat, I think. It is so warm. It's got like the padded sections all the way down, but they're like on a diagonal, so they're really flattering. And then rather than having like a big hood, it's just got like the kind of like funnel neck around the top and then dead nice long sleeves. It feels really, really warm. And I just love a coat like this. I just think it always looks nice. It's the kind of thing I wear all the time for like school runs or taking the boys to football or taking the dogs out for a walk. Like when I'm not needing to dress up i live in a black hoodie a black pair of leggings and black trainers and like a coat like this when the weather's like as freezing as it is here in the uk so i absolutely love this so um it would look so nice just with a hoodie underneath so when i try it on i will show you how i would wear it and how i was to style it day to day because i think it will look really nice and then these bits have like a toggle so you can actually like pull it in so it's like tight around the neck if you wanted to as well, oh if I can do it, can't do it with these nails, yeah like that, so then it'll tighten around the neck if you wanted to but yeah that is so nice, really really nice, see I can't even remember what shoes I ordered now so let's open these up and have a little look, oh yes I do remember, so I ordered these amazing boots to go with a dress that is in here somewhere, um, I love a pair of white boots for winter. I don't know what it is, but I always buy a really nice, cute little pair of white boots. And I saw these and I just fell in love with them. I love that they're like painting because one of the problems as well with a white boot is that quite often they'll have like a black sole and then you end up scuffing the white with the black of the sole. So I thought these would be perfect because that won't happen because they are painting so they're not gonna scuff, but also the sole is like a nice nudie color so that's a winner. Um, yeah, I just absolutely love them. I bought, wore the, I got these to wear with a dress in there because I've got a couple of like Christmassy nights out coming up. And I wanted to wear boots but and not be freezing cold um, and have like freezing cold feet. So I got these to go with the dress. So I will show you the dress actually now and then I can try it on for you as well. So this is the dress that I got to wear with the white boots. If I can get it the right way up. Oh no, it's a play suit. Yeah, of course it's a play suit. Yeah, so this is the play suit that I got to wear with the little white boots. So it's this gorgeous like white and blue print, which I absolutely love. Like Lorna Lux's range for In The Style did this same kind of print and I loved it. So when I saw this, I just thought that's so, so lovely. It's just me. It's got like a blazer kind of effect top to it. And then you can pin like, pull it in at the waist with a belt. There's the matching one if you wanna do matching. And then it's got like a crossover front. 
Um, so it's like a skirt kind of effect, but they are actually like shorts. But what I liked about them is they're like, they're like some place suits aren't very nice flared. These are like a flared short, so they should be super flattering. I got a size 10 in this one um, because I wanted it to be a bit bigger and baggier and a bit looser. So yeah, I will try that on with the boots and see how it looks. Hopefully, I will absolutely love that. And then on a more casual vibe, which you know I am all about the casual, I just picked up this sweatshirt. It says Darling on it in pink and I just thought it was really cute. I love a white sweatshirt. I just love it teamed with like light blue mum jeans, pair of trainers. I just think it's such a casual, like easy to throw on kind of outfit. So I got this in a size medium because I wanted it to be nice and big and baggy. And I think it's really cute. It feels really nice. The material feels really nice. It looks like a nice fit, like it's gonna fit really lovely. So yeah, I'm dead happy with that. That's really nice. So I'll try that on as well. And then I also got these joggers. So these are like a gray jogger, which yes, I do not need any more gray joggers in my life, but to be fair to me, they are different. So these have like a seam down the front so they're kind of like a different effect the other ones i've got are more like a, just like a 90s jogger whereas these have this kind of seam detail down and then they have like white stripes on the side so i just thought they were really nice and again i think because they have got that seam detail it's one of those that you could dress up with a pair of heels and even maybe like a white shirt and just make them look really really nice like that like dressy so I think they'd look really nice because they've got the big cuff. I think they'd look really nice with a pair of like tie-up heels or something like that. So I'm going to try those on and see. That was my thinking behind it. I got a size 10. I always size up in joggers. These look like a really nice big oversized fit. So I think they're going to be perfect. The material feels really nice on them. So yeah, I think they're going to be really, really nice. So that's those. And then next. Oh, I picked up this little day dress because I just couldn't resist it. I thought it looked really, really sweet. It's like a grey, like, check. Like a grey check, so I thought it was, like, super Christmassy. And because it's got nice long sleeves, you know, I thought it'd be really nice even for, like, Christmas Day or Christmas Eve or something like that when we're doing stuff. So, yeah, it's got, like, a milkmaid effect kind of, like, neckline. So it's going to come, like, here off the shoulders. Little puffed shoulders, which I always love. They're super flattering on my shape. And then, like, the arms again are, like, gathered and then, like, got, um, like, gathered at the wrist. And then it just come, nips in at the waist and then just, um, is, like, a little kind of flowy, flowy dress. So I'll try that on. I think that's going to look really nice with a pair of over knee boots as well. Or, like, cowboy boots or something. Like, super cute. So, yeah, I really like that. It's dead, dead Christmassy. I got a size 10 again in this one. I just like dresses and play suits to be a little bit bigger and not like not like super tight. I always get them a size up so they're a bit looser. So yeah, that's really, really nice. I like that one. Okay. Oh, and I also got this cute little bag, which I thought would go really nice with the, um, the blue and white play suit and boots little combo because it has like a long strap as well that you can put on it. So I thought either or, I can either put it with a long strap or I can just hold it like it'd be really cute just held with a little dress and boots and I really like that. It's so cute, like it's really structured, like it's got, really holds its shape and then it's got this cute little um, top to it and it's just, oh I think that's really sweet. But then you could also put this chain with it too. So yeah, it also has this little chain, so I think that's going to look really cute, like a crossbody or just over my shoulder with the little bag as well. So yeah, I absolutely love that. That's really lovely. That's a really cute bag for Christmas. And then I also picked up this really cute little bucket hat, which I have already worn. I wore it with the jacket that's in here actually just peeping out of this one. I love a bucket hat. I just think they're so cute, and especially with like, big teddy hoodies or like a big, I want to wear this with like, um, like a hoodie as well. I wore it with like a puffer jacket, but I want to wear it with a hoodie too. And cause it's like the cord, it's really, really cute. So I like that one a lot. It's like a cream beigey cord effect. And also I think that would look really nice right the way through to summer as well. It's going to look really cute with some little white tops and denim shorts and stuff through to spring. So I think like if you've not got a bucket hat, I think it's definitely one that's still going to go through into the new year. So I would definitely say like invest in one, they're really cute. 
Okay, and then next I've got to show you two pairs of jeans. Now, I have so many jeans in my wardrobe. It wasn't long ago that I cleared out my whole bottom drawer of joggers and jeans and somehow it's full again. So when I was looking at jeans, because I love pretty little thing jeans, I wanted to get a couple of pairs that were quite different. So these ones I got are like a cord. So they're like a light blue cord, but they're a mum jean um, style. So I'm not sure exactly how they're gonna look on. I'm gonna roll the bottoms up probably pop them with some trainers, maybe like the little white sweatshirt or something like that. But I just thought they were really, really different. So they're like a blue cord. So they're kind of like a denim, but kind of like, just a bit different and a bit more edgy. So I got a size 10 in those always. They do look kind of big, to be honest. So we'll try them on and see how they look on, but they do feel really nice and the color is really lovely on those. And then the other pair of jeans that I picked up are these, which are like a balloon style jean. Now I got a size eight in these, I'm sure I did. Yeah, I got a size eight um, because I thought they're gonna be big anyway, so I don't want them to be too big, but they're actually massive. Like the waist looks really small and I know they are balloon jeans and they're supposed to like pop out a little bit, but they do look kind of big. So I think these are gonna be the one that you're gonna have, definitely gonna have to wear with a pair of heels. I think they will look really nice. Um, so I'm going to try them on with a pair of heels, maybe like a little white t-shirt or something like that and see how they look. But yeah, they're definitely very balloon, very big, but I do like them. The, the quality feels really good on them and, and yeah, they could go either way. So I'll try those on in a second as well. And then these two things I kind of picked up to wear together as a bit of a tracksuit. So I love all the little pretty little thing slogan stuff. I've got a couple of their hoodies. I've got bits of gym wear and they're just really, really nice, just like basic everyday pieces to have. So I got this, which is like khaki, oversized, huge oversized sweatshirt. I got it in a size large because I wanted it to be super big. And I haven't actually got a hoodie or a sweatshirt in this color. Um, like I say, I live in black sweatshirts. So I thought I'd try this and I thought, what would I wear it with? So I actually got it with some of the khaki leggings. Um, and these are like the ruched effect on the bum ones, which are supposed to be super flattering. So I got those, so we'll see how they look on the bum. They do look a little bit see-through, so I might have to be careful what I wear them with, but I'm gonna wear them with the jumper over the top anyway. So I got those to kind of wear together. I got these leggings in a size eight. They look a little, I don't know, it's hard to tell, but they look nice and high-waisted. And I think with the jumper and the leggings together, they're gonna look really cute. So I'll try those on in a sec. And then I also ordered this puffer jacket, which is slightly different to all the coats that I've got. Loads of the coats I've got are really long. They're like long, like, kind of like what I think of as a football jacket, where I wear them to football, stand on the sidelines in the rain, freezing cold. So I actually got this just to have a bit of an alternative. And it is this gorgeous like sandy color and I love it on. I got it in a size 10 so it's slightly bigger um, and it's really nice. It's really like boxy, it's like crop so it just fits like, just like where your, it just fits like just above your bum. It's really nice and flattering. The hood's really nice and big. It's really nice, I love it. So I got this in a size 10. Just for every day, it looks really nice with just jeans. I wore it with a little bucket hat and like jeans and trainers and I really loved it. It was a really nice little outfit. Um, but I just thought this color's super nice. I don't really have much in this color, so I really like that one as well. So I'll put the link for that below. And then I picked up this little bag. I always love pretty little thing accessories. Their bags and stuff are so nice. And I was really impressed with this little bag. I thought it looked much more expensive than like a pretty little thing one. I thought it looked more like a little Zara bag or something. I just thought it was really like chic looking. So it's a little black kind of quilted, long sleeve little bag. Let me show you. There we go. So it just has this long strap and it's quilted on the front and then it has this little tassel. I just thought it's a really sweet little bag to have for little nights out. Um, or just to chuck on over the day, in the day, just like this. I just thought it was really, really cute. So yeah, I really like that. I think I'm really happy with that. And it actually feels really lovely. Like, the quality is so good on it. And inside it's like lined and stuff. So it's really nice quality. So that will look really nice with loads of little dresses and stuff at Christmas. I love that. Oh, and this is my Christmas jumper. 
which isn't very Christmassy, but it will do. So it's a friend's Christmas jumper and it's just got the, I don't know if you can even see it, it's just got Chandler and then Phoebe with the turkey on her head. So it looks a bit like vintagey and worn um, and it's just white oversized and it just says friends on it. That's my Christmas jumper for this year. So I don't know when I'm going to wear it because, I don't know, I'm not wearing it on Christmas day. I might wear it Christmas Eve maybe, but that was really cute. I got it in a size large and it is really nice and big and oversized. And I love that. Friends is my absolute favourite. So that's going to look really cute on. And then the other accessories I picked up were some sunnies. I have lost my other pair of round sunglasses. So I got these ones. They're like super diddy little small round ones. But they're just these little tiny little round black frame sunnies. Which I've always I've picked up a few pairs of these from Pretty Little Thing before. And they're really, really cute. So I got those because they're always nice for like wintry outfits. I always think as well, just have a nice pair of black sunnies too. And then I also got this, which is a black and white shirt. I love pretty little things like oversized shirts. I've got a couple of their satin, like silky kind of ones. And I just thought this would be really nice to have in my wardrobe for Christmas. So it's just a black and white striped oversized shirt. But I always think these look so nice, especially with like a little black leather skirt and some over knee boots or some je black jeans and some nice heels or something like that. I actually really like the fit on that. It's so big and oversized. I love it. And the sleeves are really nice and big and wide. I think this is going to look so good on. It's got big like huge cuffs and buttons. Oh I love it. Yes. That is so lovely. Oh it's one size. But that's so lovely. This is going to look really good on, I can just tell. It looked really nice with little skirts, little skorts. I've got some amazing black leather shorts actually from Topshop that this would look really nice with. So I will try that on as well, but that is definitely staying. Shirt. I got this sweatshirt, I think to wear with the sage kind of green joggers, but actually when I've just had them together just now, they're slightly different colours, so we'll see. I'll try them on together and see what it looks like on, but I got this in a size medium, but the thing I liked about this was the high neck. I love a high neck on a jumper, on a sweatshirt especially, I just think it looks so, so nice. I love the green colour on it. I just love jumpers like this, I have so many of them, I just think they're so easy just to chuck on, pair of leather pants, pair of trainers, so yeah that is really nice, I got that in a size medium. And last but not least I picked up a little bit of gym wear, I love pretty little thing gym wear because it's so different and it's so out there and so like, kind of like sexy but without being too like, oh I'm trying to be sexy in the gym if you know what I mean, um, but I got these, these are like a black like capri pant kind of length legging but this section is mesh so really it's like a cycling short with just a mesh bottom um, but they're really nice, they're super high waisted I've tried these on already, they looked really nice on the material feels good on them the, I love the waistband, the waistband's just like so thick and high and then yeah the bottoms are like this mesh which are really nice and then I also got this which is a pretty little thing branded long sleeve gym top. I like this again as well. I love a long sleeve gym top. I always wear loads of like black long sleeve stuff in the gym. I don't like having my arms out at all. And this is really cute. I think it looked really nice with joggers as well. It's like stretchy, like elasticated around the stomach. So I'm not 100% sure how that is gonna be like flattering wise, because I'm not a fan of having something elasticated around my stomach in a crop top, but we will see. But yeah. So I got those two for the gym, so I will try those on. That is everything out of the bags. So I'm going to try everything on for you now and see how it all looks on together and put some outfits together and stuff like that. Aquel se ve se de cuenta que aquí perdió esa mujer Lo que quiere es enloquecer, ser la mujer que él quería ver Esa chica quiere selfie, selfie que yo parezca en él Como que ella quiere, disfruta la noche, lo anormal Creo que el novio teme, que su relación va a terminar Se da cuenta que no Necesita alguien más 
Quiero un selfie para su Instagram right. Ella ya no quiere relación De alguien que diga su condición Que solamente le dé traición Pa' después llegar con un perdón Quiere andar y ser desesperado Goza la vida y lo hacen como Esa chica ladies. quiere selfie, selfie, ella quiere ver Ella quiere ver Porque el se de cuenta Que aquí perdió esa mujer, perdió esa mujer Lo que quiere es lo que se hace la mujer que quería ver Esa chica quiere selfie, selfie, que yo parezca en mí, que yo parezca en mí No tiene sueños, solamente en sus sueños Nos ponemos risueños con un norteño mi flow brasileño, yo te juro que es bueno Ay, 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 ya me doy el palo Hace parte si lo desigualo Le gusta lo nasty y lo malo Te traje un regalo Ella ya no quiere relación De alguien que diga su condición Que solamente le dé traición Pa' después llegar con un perdón Quiere andar y ser de esos Goza la vida y lo hacen como Esa chica ladies. quiere selfie, selfie, ella quiere ver, ella quiere ver Porque el CP se dé cuenta que aquí perdió esa mujer, perdió esa mujer Lo que quiere es lo que se hace la mujer que quería ver Esa chica quiere selfie, selfie, que yo parezca en mí, que yo parezca en mí Dime todo lo que ella quiere, nada ha sido regalado Entre más independiente Esa chica quiere selfie, selfie, ella quiere ver Pa' que el CP se dé cuenta que aquí perdió esa mujer Lo que quiere es enloquecer, ser la mujer que él quería ver Esa chica quiere selfie, selfie, que yo parezca en mí Como que ella quiere, disfruta la noche, lo anormal Creo que el novio teme su relación va a terminar Se da cuenta que no necesita alguien más Quiere un selfie para su Instagram right. Ella ya no quiere relación De alguien que diga su condición Que solamente le dé traición Pa' después llegar con un perdón Quiere andar y ser de esos pibis Que goza la vida y lo hacen como Esa chica ladies. quiere selfie, selfie, ella quiere ver Ella quiere ver Porque el CP se dé cuenta Que aquí perdió esa mujer, perdió esa mujer Lo que quiere es enloquecer, ser la mujer que él quería ver Esa chica quiere selfie, selfie, que yo parezca en mí, que yo parezca en mí No tiene sueños, solamente en sus sueños Nos ponemos risueños con un norteño mi flow brasileño, yo te juro que es bueno Ay, 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 ya me doy el palo Hacen parte si lo desigualo Le gusta lo nasty y lo malo Me traje un regalo Ella ya no quiere relación De alguien que diga su condición Que solamente le dé traición Pa' después llegar con un perdón Quiere andar y ser de esos pibis que goza la vida y lo hacen como Esa chica ladies. quiere selfie, selfie, ella quiere ver, ella quiere ver Porque el CP se dé cuenta que aquí perdió esa mujer, perdió esa mujer Lo que quiere es enloquecer, ser la mujer que él quería ver Esa chica
que quieres ser que Quiero que yo 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 qui